Busang, everybody. That is how to say good morning in Vietnamese. It was suggested by, let me just double check. It was suggested by Amy to start today's vlog in Vietnamese. So here I am. Hope you guys liked that little intro. <laughs> let me know down below what language you would like me to start next vlog in. I have done so many languages. So before you like comment what language you want me to do, just have a look through like my previous vlogs because I've been doing it for like the past two weeks, I want to say. And I've learned how to say good morning in in quite a lot of languages by now so that's really good so today it is a Monday and Monday is usually like not a very nice day because it's like the beginning of the week it's not the weekend anymore but today is actually quite a nice day it's like really sunny outside so me and Matt are probably just gonna do some garden work we still have to kind of finish painting the shed and stuff so we just want to like be outside I've just edited my vlog from last night so I am basically free to do whatever I like today. By the way guys, yesterday me and Matt went out to basically film a time lapse of the stars as you probably know already if you've seen my last previous vlog and it actually turned out really cool. Like the only thing that isn't great about it is the fact that it's a little bit out of focus it's not as sharp as we would have liked it but at least now we know how the app works so I'm just quickly gonna show you guys the clip so this is the clip Me and Matt were very determined to get that clip. It literally took us like so long. We had to actually fall asleep in the car and like sleep part of the night in the car. And then we got home like super, super late, but it was actually quite creepy because we literally had to be in this like secluded field in the middle of nowhere and it was just us in the car and we had to like turn all the lights off and everything because otherwise it would spoil the photos um because basically a time lapse for those of you who don't know it's just like a series of photos that are taken every 30 seconds and then kind of merged into a short little like clip so that is why it was only like seven seconds long but i think it was really worth it because now we know how to do it for the future so we're definitely going to be doing more like time lapse things for the vlog so yeah keep your eyes peeled for that so guys i have actually just found some poppy seeds i actually got these as like part of a gift from sherry Ann and luca so i so I'm gonna plant some and I have no idea how to plant plants I've never planted anything in my life, but I'm gonna attempt and we'll see how it goes Okay, so got my glove apparently what you're meant to do is dig a 0.5 centimeter Like dip so apparently these are meant to be flowering between May and August so We'll see probably won't see them for a little while, but it's worth a shot. Okay, there's a lot of ants in this flower bed. Oh God. I guess there's not much to it. I have no idea if I did this right, but I guess in a few months time, we will see. So guys, because today is such a nice day again, me and Matt have actually decided we're gonna go on like a little road trip. So we're gonna take out the bikes in our car somewhere, like not around this kind of area. And we're gonna go for a nice little stroll on the bikes, if you can even do that on bikes. Um, whoa, it's so dark. Uh, can you guys see me? Okay, there we go. So yeah, Matt's just trying to figure out where we're gonna go and we should be on our way very soon. So guys, we are now on the bike ride and by the way, we forgot our wallet. Like how annoying is that? Because I was meant to be bringing this backpack and we were like kind of thinking whether we should bring this one or the other one and I ended up leaving my wallet in the other backpack. So now we have no money and like we wanted to have a picnic. <laughs> But we're gonna get in the car, right? And just go for yeah. a picnic anyway. What, subway? Yeah, we're probably gonna get a subway. <laughs> like, so close to the camera. Probably gonna get a subway and just like eat it out in the park. So, Sounds yeah, good. That's the plan. By the way, I just quickly want to address when people comment on my vlog saying that me and Matt should start wearing helmets, like, guys, we get that you're being like looking out for us and stuff, but we don't actually cycle on the road, so we don't really feel like there's any need to get helmets because we're safe. Like, and we're really slow. <laughs> We don't, not, we don't do anything cars. dangerous. Exactly, it's not like we're cycling out on the road and being dangerous, so this is literally like, show them the area we're cycling now. It's just like a bike route, so it's not like you need a helmet for that. Yeah, don't worry guys, if we're gonna like cycle on the actual road, then we'll get helmets, don't worry. So guys, we have made it to the park. We actually picked up a subway and some other snacks, so we're just gonna enjoy the view enjoy the weather tuck into some food because i am starving so yeah that's basically what we're up to now look how beautiful it is in this park 
Like it's so pretty. This is our current view. And yeah. We are now back home from our little picnic and we have actually decided to teach ourselves how to play Go TA somebody that I used to know. Matt actually used to be able to play it on the ukulele. I never could play it on anything, so I just thought it's quite a nice song to learn. Matt's getting there. everyone so today I'm not actually starting the vlog in a different language because I'm in a little bit of a rush and I didn't actually have time to check your comments to like find out what language I'm gonna start it in but don't worry I'll be back to normal tomorrow but basically I'm in a rush today because I'm actually heading off to the train station this morning because I'm gonna be attending a Instagram slash Facebook event now I'm not really too sure what goes on at this kind of event but I was invited so I thought well I love Instagram I love social media so I might as well go so that's basically what's going on um so i'm heading off to london now matt's just gonna drop me off and yeah today is actually a little bit of a gloomy day but i'm rocking the colors you know got a bit of a um, pop of color on a gloomy day so yeah <laughs> i don't know what i'm what i'm why i'm rambling but anyways um i'm gonna go now so <gasps> a bird was so close <laughs> I'm gonna go now and I'll speak to you guys when I get there. So guys, I have made it to the Instagram and Facebook event. So this is it. <laughs> so there's like a bunch of things that we can kind of explore around here. There's um, Helen, Hobby, and Coach all there. So I'm just basically gonna have a little browse around and yeah, I'm gonna take you guys in with me. Basically, we've got a bunch of like these big gaming things <laughs> where you can like play Pac-Man and stuff. So these are like the new games on Facebook and they also got some Oculus things. So there's some people playing it. <laughs> I actually have an Oculus myself. So this is like fun to watch what games like they're bringing out. It's really cool. Hey guys, so I am now in the cab. I'm just on my way to the train station. Um, yeah, the meetup, well not meetup, the um, event was actually really, really fun. Like, it was really fun trying new games for the Oculus and stuff. So yeah, I'm definitely excited for that when they like eventually come out. Um, but yeah, basically that is me finished in London. So I'm just gonna head home now. I'm gonna get the train back. So I should be home in about an hour's time and I'll catch up with you guys then. Hey guys, so I have made it back home. I have just had an Anders and I'm like so boiling right now. <laughs> I ate it way too quick and it's really hot today. So I'm quite happy, but I'm just like really sweaty and boiling. So my face is like super shiny, but I have actually popped around to my manager's office today and I picked up a lot of like PR kind of packages from my PO box. So I thought I'd quickly show you guys. So basically the first thing that I got oh, is this huge box from NYX and inside is like a bunch of their foundations. Look how cool is that? That is so cool. Oh god, it's Patrick and Samantha. That's so cool. So basically these are like all the shades you would literally ever need and because I already have like NYX makeup and stuff I'm probably gonna put this in my giveaway as well. So the next thing that I got from my PO box is like this box from Benefit and when you open it up you get like a few different products in here so you get like the hula bronzer the dandelion uh this is a blush i think and then the hula light 
And then, oh, what's this? Oh, this is like a hula contour stick. And then, oh, that's just like a lollipop. <laughs> I thought it was like a piece of makeup. Um, and then at the bottom, look how cute this is. It's like a little, oh, uh, I'm struggling with one hand. It's like a little chair, like a little beach chair. <laughs> how cute is that? You can put your phone on it or something. Another thing that I got is the Ciate London Glow Blushes. How cute. So you get like a set of five different blushes in here. <gasps> How pretty is that? Oh my god, that's so pretty. Oh. I then also got these five nail polishes from Nails Inc. Nails Inc. I always say Nails Inc. I don't know if it's Nails Inc. I think it's... Yeah, it is Nails Inc. Um, and then they also sent me some of these face masks and this really cool charcoal purifying mask this is quite cool quite a nice size too because it's kind of like travel friendly and then on the side i also got these rimmel london brow this way fiber pencils so you get those in three different shades and then the last thing i'm really excited for is this little package from tanya burr so basically inside you get this little picture of tanya look how pretty she looks let's open this up together so the first thing you see is the kind of like sheet of all her makeup products like her new range and then a picture of her and then on top was actually this little note that says dearest Roxy enjoy my new collection love Tarn thanks Tarn <laughs> so inside oh my god what the hell that is adorable oh my god do you guys see this it's a copper pineapple this is actually my dreams like in, in an object um, so I don't even know what this is I think it's like a container but let's look at the actual products so inside you see these two lipsticks so the first one is called Sunday Walk and the other one is called Bear Hug so these are really pretty colors actually they're very like nude and me I really love those and then we have these two eyeshadow palettes from Tanya Burr as well so this is the first one oh the colors are really pretty that's nice and then this one here is the my paradise palette oh wow that's really pretty too so the colors are very like neutral muted kind of brown so there's one matte shadow and then three shimmery shadows so that was my little like p.o box haul am i in focus i don't know but anyways um i'm really like thankful for everyone that has sent me this stuff like all the brands and obviously Big thanks to Tanya for sending me this because I'm excited to try it and I love this little pineapple thing. Do you need to figure out what it is? It just says pineapple container. I think you can open it. So guys, you can actually open this. How cool is that? I don't know what I'm going to put inside, but this is definitely going in my room. I'm now actually going to head off to rugby because my parents are going to pick me up any moment. And I'm going to spend the night over in rugby just because I'm not really going to be able to see my parents for a while because I'm going away on Thursday. So I thought I would visit them like for the day well for the night and then tomorrow i'll be there too um so that i can kind of like see them before i leave to ibiza and yeah i'm actually leaving tomorrow night to go to the hotel so i'm gonna have to come back at like 3 ish p.m so i can like pack because i still haven't packed or anything and i also have a video that i need to film tomorrow so yeah it's gonna be quite a busy day i was actually meant to get my eyelashes filled because a lot of them have started to fall out like especially on this eye here and I've realized I actually won't be able to make my appointment because I'm gonna have to film a video tomorrow, meaning that I can't stay in rugby for too long and my appointment was meant to be at like 4, 4 30 and that's like way too late because my taxi is coming here at 8 p.m. and I'm meant to be going to the airport to stay in a hotel there with Sabrina. So yeah, I'm sadly not gonna be able to get my lashes done so I'll either have to go with my lashes like this or I'm just gonna have to take them off um, myself, which Either of those doesn't really sound too appealing to me, but I'm just going to have to make do. But anyways, I'm going to head off to rugby now because my parents are going to be here any moment. So I'll speak to you guys when I get there.